prepare your NMR sample, here's what you'll need. Your test tube and rack, solvent height guide, NMR sample, solvent, and tube, spatula, and pipettes and bulbs. Also, always remember to have your goggles and your gloves. Grab your test tube and NMR tube. First, measure out your sample. For proton NMR, you'll want at least 10 milligrams of sample. For carbon NMR, you might need up to 50 milligrams of sample. Now add your sample to a test tube. Now we're going to dissolve our sample. Uncap the NMR solvent. And now make sure you use a clean pipette to draw from the NMR solvent. Add about half a pipette full, or about 0.7 to 0.9 mils of solvent to your sample. And remember, never add contaminated solvent back into the NMR solvent container. And remember to always recap the NMR solvent container. Now dissolve your sample by mixing it a little bit. The third step is to filter your sample. Do this if you have any impurities. You can use a cotton sand or sea light filter as shown here. Now we're going to transfer our sample. Using a pipette, transfer your sample into the NMR tube. Now compare your sample solvent height. Take your NMR tube and compare it to the solvent height guide. Here, our sample is a little low. We're going to add a little more solvent using a clean pipette, remember, from the NMR solvent container, and just add a little more solvent until it matches the line for your professor on the NMR solvent height guide. Step six is to cap your sample. Make sure you put your cap on straight. If it's tilted a little bit, it will offset your sample reading in the NMR. Here's an example of a bad cap. Here's what your finished sample should look like. To summarize, first measure out your sample, then dissolve it in the NMR solvent, filter it if necessary, transfer it to the NMR tube, compare the solvent height to that of the solvent height guide, and then finally cap your tube properly.